Welcome to this week's Simon. I'm Xia. And I'm Irene from the Scientific Affairs team here at Illumina. Did you know that it is extremely rare for elephants to get cancer? You do not expect me to buy that. There are huge animals that live a long time. More time and more cells. If anything, I would expect the opposite. You know, it is an old paradox, but cancer does not increase for larger body size or lifespan. But how do you even establish if an elephant gets cancer? Well, you know, Abaglin and co-workers performed a survey of cancer resistance in 664 elephants. Body size appears to be irrelevant in determining cancer risk. The cancer mortality for elephants is as low as 4.8%. Wow. In humans, that would be 11 to 25%. But why would that be? You know, the real question is how, not why. The authors discovered that elephants have at least 20 copies of the crucial tumor suppressor gene TP53. You mean the guardian of the genome? Well, exactly. That gene, which by the way, is mutated in most human cancers. I can see that now. Humans contain only one copy of TP53, which means two alleles. Inherited mutations in one allele can lead to a 90% lifetime risk for cancer. A single cell in which the unaffected allele also mutates will develop three major cancer characteristics. Absence of programmed cell death or apoptosis, increased cell proliferation, and genomic instability. Well, not if you have 20 copies of the gene. Cultured lymphocytes treated with ionizing radiation showed that apoptosis was significantly higher in elephant cells when compared to humans. Well, that makes sense from an evolutionary perspective. The enormous mass, the extended lifespan, and the reproductive advantage of older elephant selected a very efficient and fail-safe method for cancer suppression. Incredible how evolution of a species that is so different from us can tell us so much about human disease. But that's all for today. We love to hear your thoughts about our show and topics you would like us to discuss in the future. Subscribe to our channel and be sure to follow us on social media, hashtag Simon. Until next time, bye. Bye.